crazy? You up here? I'm telling Mom you threw a rock at me. It was a pine cone, you baby. Ow! That was a rock. I'm warning you. Looks like the Aquato family circus has traveled through here all right. Yep, we had to hightail it out into the woods because you're ashamed of being an Aquato. I'll stop being ashamed of that if you stop being ashamed of being a psychic. <laughs> oh, you're asking for it, Raspy. Frazy, it's okay. You can tell Dad now. You don't have to hide anymore. <sighs> this is your last warning. Frazy? More where that came from. entrance to the forgetful forest is somewhere here in the questionable area. Guess my family has chosen where to set up the Aquato Dome. Thank you. Are those the acorns I asked for? Yes? No. No, they can't be, can they? No, because I asked for acorns that were crushed, didn't I? Didn't I, Fur Lancelot? I hate to yell at you, Fur Lancelot, but I... I... I am the crushed one. It crushes my heart to see you not doing your best. Understand? Now, do I need to show you how to crush things? No? You sure? Okay. Good boy. Now, try again. But this time, think about personal commitment and delivering excellence every day. All right? Sorry you had to see that, Raz. Narrow slot that I don't think I can fit through.
rabbit poop. Hey, Sam. Talk fast. Cakes are cooking. I have some questions about pancakes. <laughs> Start flapping, Jack. Why didn't you just go order some pancakes at the cafeteria? Agent Oleander didn't give me any money. I assumed to test my resourcefulness. What's your recipe? Just the basics, you know, eggs, milk, flour. Found most of it here, with a couple quick substitutions. What sort of substitutions? If I told you, it would compromise the perceived flavor profile. Isn't that just straight up dirt? For the umami. Weren't all the supplies here kinda old? Look, you can't take the expiration dates too seriously. They're just the food industry, protecting itself from lawsuits. And protecting us from, like, food poisoning? Psst. No one's getting sick from my pancakes. Unless one of you jerks didn't wash their hands. Eh, better late than never. Where'd you get the milk? From the goats? Oh, yeah, that would have been easier. <laughs> hey, it brought us closer, Fran. You used eggs you found here? Old eggs? No! Gross! I found some fresh ones. And you know, if you use enough syrup, you can't tell chicken from snake. Eggs is eggs. Can I have a pancake? You can have any that fall on the floor. Thanks. Where'd you learn how to make pancakes? Prison. Wait, what did I say? I meant from my mother. I'm out of pancake questions. Good, because I'm out of pancake puns. What are you doing out here? Well, you know my intern mentor, Coach Morso Oleander? Uh, yeah. Well, this is the first assignment he gave me. Mission. Get me some pancakes so I can think. I think it's supposed to teach me something about the many layers of the mind. Maybe. I know the butter stands for lateral thinking. I got that much. Can I ask you about your family? Why? Because my last name is Bool? And because that's a famous family in the Psy community? And you want to network with me to further your Psy career? Go for it. I'm a friend of your brother's. Hmm. Your head looks remarkably unexploded. Must be the helmet. Has your brother Dogen really made someone's head explode? No, never. Wait, you mean someone who didn't deserve it? No. I mean, like, anybody. Look, nobody's nerfect. <laughs> Am I right? Can everyone in the Bull family talk to animals? Most of us can talk to them, but few of us really know how to listen to the animals. You know, for instance, I can hear you rolling your eyes, Mrs. Thatcher. What can you tell me about Compton? Mm, Gramps is nice and all, but honestly, he's a little weird. No, still too tough. Okay, I'll stop asking about your family. The bull's got nothing to hide. Unlike some of these squirrels. Relax, I'm talking about your nuts. You guys still hide nuts, right? You guys, learn to laugh a little, okay? You'll live longer. So, have you always wanted to be a psychonaut too? <sighs> Not really. My true dream is to be a pet therapist, because I'm really good with animals. Right, guys? Are you worried about Maligula? Raz, Maligula's ancient history. My grandpa killed her by triggering an elephant stampede. What? I never heard huh. about... You believe the official story, do you? I gotta go. Catch you on the flip side. <laughs>
Yes, it is funny every time. That pancake is for Agent Oleander. You can have the ones on the floor. I doing out here again? Oh, right. Compton needs a bee from the forgetful forest. God, I'm good at this. <clears throat> out of my kitchen, Raz. Unless you want to end up a pancake. Don't you guys think I should have my own cooking show? Focus a little longer with my clairvoyance. Ooh, that's a good one. Almost had it. I just need to focus a little longer with my clairvoyance. bigger side pouch at the automatic if I'm gonna pick up any more Citanium. Welcome to the questionable area, where the only answer is more questions? What's with all the question marks? Or it hurts somebody.
this card lying around. Yep. Haunted water wheel? Round and round it goes. What makes it go, nobody knows. Uh, it's water, dummies. Jeez, this place is a little weird. Forgive you. Mom? I mean, if little children never ran away from home, where would the circus get her workers, huh? Uh. What matters is that the Aquatos are all together again. And this little adventure of yours has actually given me fresh inspiration for our act. Me too! Did you see that unnatural and slightly gimmicky waterfall over there? The one flowing upside down? Stay away from it. No water. Too late, Nonna. It has already watered the flower of inspiration in my heart and blossomed in two. Guess what I called it. Guess. The upside down waterfall? The devil's fire hose. Let's show our runaway how we do it, everybody. Creepy on the bottom. This would be easier if you didn't use so much hair grease. It'd be easier if your head weren't so pointy. Now, Rasputin, up top you go. Yes, son. And then you could add a little psychic flourish by levitating this pine cone. No, no. Then we pass each person up the tower like water flowing. No psychic flourishes. I told you. We. Oui. Our acrobats. We don't do parlor tricks. Uh, guys. Why not a little of both? Pops. Oh, cretin. You guys. Oh, shush. This is why we taught you how to fall as babies. <sighs> it's no use. We need the aquatodome. <laughs> I'm on it. Help him out, would you, Pooty? He's had to take on so much extra work since you abandoned your family and broke our hearts. That's a good boy. If there's one thing the Aquatos know how to do, it's making themselves at home. Anywhere.
Nona. Oh, hello, my sweet little turnip. Are you comfortable? Do you need anything? I'm happy as long as I'm with my family. Aren't you cold out here in the woods? Ah, oh, please. I'm from Golovia. This is nothing. Can I ask you about the curse? Don't go near the water. Yes, I know about that part, but then you know the whole thing. All you need to know. Do you hate psychics as much as mom? You mean fortune tellers? Like the Galonkios, the ones who cursed us? They are not natural. They are not trustworthy. Nona, who's your favorite grandchild? It's me, right? Oh, of course, you are my favorite. My sweet little Dion. Well, I gotta go back to my spy stuff. Good boy, now don't get that big head. Nice trick, Tala. Is Nona looking? Yes, and she looks really impressed. <laughs> Nice trick, Tala. Is Nona looking? Yes, and she looks really impressed. <laughs> hey, Mom. Hmm. Oh, yes, Rasputin? What you doing? I'm trying to perfect the devil's fire hose, of course. It's a risky one, but I think this might be the spectacle that puts the Aquatos back on top. Can I help? Yes. Tell me how to make the devil's fire hose reach even greater heights. How about some sight? Finish that sentence and it will kill your mother, Rasputin. Maybe if everyone stood on tippy toes? Everyone is already stretched to their full height. I should know. I stretch them every day. What if we incorporate animals into the act? Overall, children are cheaper and slightly cleaner. What if we set everyone's costumes on fire? Very exciting. But these are the only costumes we have, Rasputin. Seems like doing the trick horizontally would be safer. Safety doesn't fill seats, Rasputin. What if everyone were singing? Ugh, I'd rather die in water. Blindfolds? We tried that before. Remember the big pink eye epidemic? Shut us down for a week. Chainsaws? Who will pay for the gasoline, darling? Well, that's all the ideas I got. Sorry. Hmm. You really want to help me? Go find your brother, Queepy. He's wandered off again. Top of what? Top of the acrobatic world, Rasputin. As the Aquatos once were. Before the curse. Can I ask you about the curse? Not too loud. You know your father doesn't like to talk about it. But as you know, a cruel fortune teller cursed our family, Raz. Every Aquato for all time is cursed to die in water. That is why we had to leave our grand aquatic circus behind and start again at the bottom in this humble family troop. We may not have water anymore, but we still have the most important thing, right? We still have family. highly stretchable ligaments. Oh, yes, and family. Who cursed us? Too many questions. Stay away from the water! That's all you need to know. I stopped arguing with that woman long ago. You know, Agent Forsyth is a very important psychonaut. And she's really cool, actually. I think you'd really like each other if you hung out. The woman in the suit? Ugh, we get along just fine. As long as we keep our distance. A circus can only have one prima donna. Sorry about running away. It's okay, Rasputin. I blame myself. Really? Why? I forgot to latch your door that night. You... you latch our door at night? From the outside? Only since Queepy started sleepwalking. Okay, I'm going to go practice my acrobatics. Uh-huh. Remember, every time you lie, it takes a day off your mother's life. Hey, Mom. Hmm. Oh, yes, Rasputin? Okay, I'm going to go practice my acrobatics. Uh-huh. Remember, 
every time you lie, it takes a day off your mother's life.